go. We'll find out. Right, see, there's the Gardevoir. No yeah. Blaziken today. Or not Blaziken, uh, Scizor for now. Or today. I agree with that. I would have like, questionable decision making in my mind if he went Scizor. Oh, I'll screw that Snivy, actually. Okay. Like this, it can anti air. You can combo yeah. off that, and carry him right back to the wall or Plus. corner. There you go. Boom, we're just gonna opt to try and go in right away. Doesn't want Gardevoir to build up pressure. Oh no! This is a grab, actually. It's unfortunate, you know, you don't never want to lose the first dual phase of the lost synergy gone. I like Aura, just playing sticky. I'm not really like looking for the long zone, but just going for the over under. Oh, actually, oh. armor, he did give up a little bit of health there, but he pushed him to the corner. No, something we gotta do with Blazes King. You gotta give up a little bit of health if you want to get them into the corner. It's something I would really like to see as Boom, but unfortunately, he doesn't do it too often with Brave Bird. His Brave Bird is a little bit fast enough. Oh, oh no, he got over. Just a little misspaced. That would have been godlike mm -hmm. if he had just. A little bit farther back. Flare Blitz in the heavens. Yep. Here. Yeah. I was so ready. I was like, this is gonna be a cool corner. But, gets the fuel phase. But okay. Oh, okay. Push us to the other corner. <laughs> All the wall combos over here. There's Brave Bird. Alright, I like it. Push it plus. Yeah. Keep the pressure on nice Ooh, duck. Aura with the knowledge. Not something we see too often from a lot of players. That is really nice to see. So one thing interesting is we will actually opt for the Whimsicott instead of the W. Actually, the activation of the yeah, oh, Whimsicott actually activating the energy ball. So he can walk around, but he can jump and act pretty much that situation. I think once the energy ball hits him, there's nothing he can do. But yeah, he still has to block it. Mm -hmm. So that's a weird support. Does it? Don't. Is it a lot? Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh. Yep, Snivy. Yep. Unfortunately, only I think certain characters can do that. Like, People like to call Snivy in first, but if you're like Charizard, I think Gengar as well, you can just like get through Snivy and it's like, goodbye. Yep. Yeah, but I forgot about uh, Snivy for Blaziken. Same. I also forgot because I play Charizard, so I'm used to being no push up the tree. Yeah. <laughs> Want a lot of damage though, even in right back up. And unfortunately, Burst is no longer there for Fumu. Fumu needs to chill out, wait for the Burst to be done. But that was a dangerous light. I, that was scary. But you can see the Whimsicott brings them back to 160. So you're trying for the instant JY when you're actually going to the grass instead. Of course you did, it too much in the world. I mean, okay, yeah. get the punch. Stay okay, really close here. Can you take it? Oh, oh I actually fell out of the couple of jumps. Oh, and nice. Blaziken grab meta. Tick grabs are underrated. They are. Especially for Blaziken, because nobody expects Blaziken to grab. Mm. They're scary on like all characters, especially like Machamp or Charizard. You get Tick grab, you're like, oh, I guess I ate 160 anyway. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Yeah, nice catch from Oro. Has full burst, so just denies it from Fumu. Actually able to confirm off the hit right? for a pickup. Oh, so much damage. Fumu playing with more patient, but it's caught going back. Oh no, Fumu getting stuck. Oh, I feel like Oro's just knowledge checking him now. Oh, actually, oh, that was, uh, that was dirty. This is looking very rough round three. Fumu is just getting checked a lot. Has to pop burst now. Perfect block here. See, Orin's just keeping him here in the corner in field phase. He just feels he doesn't seem to fully know what to do. But he uses it out. And now it's back to even off of two mix up. And one shot's up, so. That's just winning this round. Oro kind of off the buttons again. And Boom was like, I'll just press button too. I'm plus. Now, you have to be careful of Gardevoir oh. first. I don't think that catches. Yeah, the shield far back. Back. Now, both in Rage. This is a very one mix-up situation. So you can, you can uh, Brave Bird all of these. And he's almost... I feel like he's almost afraid of being caught in the air. Oh, that's, that's not gonna take it. Oh, oh that was nice. Mm -hmm. Aura, Aura, though. Yep. He had a lot of instances where Aura, Aura was throwing out the future site, so he could have Brave Bird in taking the round. And then Aura also noticed that Fumu had started playing that round a bit more patiently mm -hmm. and just holding block. So he's like, okay, I'll just dash and grab. Right. And so good adaption from really both sides. Right. We have to go back to character select. Fumu, I would be shocked if he picked the city wide. I feel like he's just switching supports. I don't think Whimsicott gave him much at all. Yeah. He, just, he gave him some health, but if you're just gonna get some health, you might as well just run Togekiss or Eevee and get that buff there. Right. Because like, Whimsicott was blocking some projectiles, but they just popped Energy Ball. Yeah. And like, well, I still can't jump. Right. So this is not helping me. Right. Which could be why uh, I think it was Tech who ran Patrizu. Or whoever yes, ran Patrizu. Yes, Tech was running Patrizu. He had Zoro last game. So that could have been why he chose Patrizu. Yep. I can switch up now. There we go. Alright, sticking with Snivy though for Oro. 
Okay, he goes back to the EV. Yeah. I need to take then. I'm gonna come up and help you out too much. Right. Stick to try and true. Dashes in. Oh, Ooh. nice catch. Go for the overheat. I'm kind of surprised. I feel like attack down would uh, help out a lot of the ship damage. But just obviously get back to field. Though so I like this, all the overhead play. Mm -hmm. Not letting those anti take them your like 45 degree angle tank hit right above. Goes and does it again and actually stuffs out the counter. I'm liking this. Boom is changing it up a lot. Getting to Oro's head a bit. Nice spacing. I'm gonna be able to block this ready. Oh. Nice and then he gets all that HP back to attack up almost that burst himself. And now Oro has to be careful about how many projectiles he throws out. You know, might end up giving Fumi burst. Right, if you just see ADC one more, it But he's actually gonna go in, it might even take it here. He doesn't even need to. Does it? That was a very clean adaption for him, Fumu. A little bit more in your face, not many Brave Birth, but he worked in the oh, overheat or heat wave? Heat wave. Heat wave to <laughs> stuff that there's. Yeah, the double heat wave. That was a. Uh... Well, I guess Tom jumping. If it works, it's good. Like, if it works, it works. No one can take that from you. Yeah. Here we go. Oro just playing the long zone game now. I him opting to walk forward actually. This way he can burst. The Fumu was actually going in and popping up really soon. I feel like he's playing, he knows he has full. He has a lot of time on the round. He could probably get burst round three. So use it now, try to build a lead. That was great from Oro, so he did not care about that. He didn't see the level either, so yeah. now he's at advantage. Fumu is playing from behind. Try to go for the tip grab, didn't expect it too wide to confirm. Pull me one. Pull me right. Yep, nice counter in there, and it's just dashing and grabbing. He's in rage and has an easy boost, so this is quite a bit of damage. It gets good spacing. And this could be big for Fumu. If he wins the field phase, he at least, even if he doesn't win the round, he secures himself a loss soon for next round. Right. Here we go. Makes Oro spend his first because he's winning himself. And if you take small victories, Fumu playing patiently. Just pops in. Madman. Playing so safe, so patient. But now you have to be careful when the shield breaks it up. Jumps over it. Oh, oh dude. Great yeah. adaptation from Aura. Yeah, it was very good from Aura to see like the shield breaks up was there. Mm -hmm. Knowing that Fumu is not going to want to give up this synergy. So knowing it's just going to jump instead. Right. Air. Fumu is looking so much stronger in this game right. too. He wants this one. Here. Fumu wants to be in that top cut for Nebraska. Someone's got to represent us. Come on, Fumu. <laughs> and the voice is Ivy, so that's off table for a little yep. bit. Oh no, jumps right into it. Oh, I thought he got through that. Oh, nice grab. You take grabs. If they're gonna let you grab them, grab them. Here we go. Oh, no. is he gonna hit? He does! Is that the game? I don't think so. I think I think Oro's I think Oro's living. Dude, the crowd is popping go, off. It goes under 100. I think he gets it. Oh! Yes. That was crazy. No bias. No, no bias. No bias. Boomu says, <laughs> "No, I'm not about to let you chew all my old state. <laughs> Sit down." This is my tournament, Oro. My tournament. I'm the Tio here. If Burnside can be in the like grand finals <laughs> of his own, I can be in the grand finals of my own. Exactly. <laughs> Crazy. Oh. <laughs> now it's up to Oro to figure out the adaption. Yeah. Fumu just got in his head first round and adapted, got in his head third round. Mm -hmm. And he's abusing the fact that Oro's trying to press buttons, waits for him to just overcommit the Snivy, waits out. And he's just like a good mix of patience and aggression. I'm so scared. <laughs> <laughs> I don't really know what to say because I'm just like, I'm so focused on the match. So I like this kind of this. Uh... Backwards walking. Ooh, questionable. Where's the flop him? Alright, here we go. Oro just playing is a bit safer, just trying to claw any of the player bits or derail your curves that are coming through. He's trying to jump out of it. He's stuff that way and he's stored power. Oh, nice call out from Oro Boy there. Put Spoon in the corner now. We must be careful. Staying a lot of chip damage down one. I see Spoon is just executing his game plan. Uh oh. Yeah? No. Oh! 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 That okay. Snivy just stalling it out long enough. And that's a perfect from Oro. Just Man. a clean adaption. Yeah, okay. Okay. Uh oh, trying to do the JY. Unfortunately, that's always the more, most skills bad, like a Gengar or Charizard to play this game. You just like, you try to go for the jump and you just end up grab trying to go for tech. Oh, but nice. Which is another corner. Oh, well, Charizard is too wide. Yep. 
Goro, unfortunately, not falling for that anymore. Wow. Start working another mix up. Maybe just go for another trigger gem. So usually, we're executing Fumu's game plan of getting into rage and then calling Eevee. Mm -hmm. No more dash. Oh, I, li I like that dash forward. I wish it was a grab. Ooh, oh, nice slide under by Oro. That is a high. Yeah. As you can see, it sucks. Or, yeah, Fury sucks. <laughs> it sucks. If you love Stance CA, it, it just feels bad. Yeah. Oh, nice station. Oh. This oh. is. Fury is already evened up. I didn't even notice that. Place your grab meta. Happening. Oro's in rage that jump pop first right okay. away. Doesn't want to deal with it. And overkick oh. the Snivy again. I, wonder, I feel like he almost used just as a wall to get to oh. future sight. Try to push him against the wall, what's gonna happen? First? Yep. Yeah. Okay, that's safe, that's safe by Fumo. I like that though, because Orange would just grab, jumping every few watts. Right. Right. This one mix-up is all Fumo needs right now to secure this okay. round. Right. Shielding, shielding, playing it safe. Low shield though, he has to be careful not to get broken. No! Oh no! This isn't, this isn't gonna be it. This is gonna be so scary though. Oh, he misses it. the jab. Makes it, makes it oh, Eevee, Eevee, Eevee. Eevee. Yes. Alright, let's see if it's the block snivy. Oh, Jumps up? He can jump! Oh, oh I can save here! He can just break word any of those. Oh. oh! Oro taking it! I, that was stressful oh. to watch. The room, you could feel the air go out of the room when that happened. Yeah, Bumu oh. trying to change it up to patient. Realize, you no. Know, Oro's just committing to going in, pressing buttons, wait for the punish. Yeah. But Oro just mixes up last.